<laughs> Look at that one. Oh, wow. Uh, apparently, nasty. this dude has never changed this filter. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this is embarrassing. All right, so today we're going to do a quick tutorial on how to change the air filter on a Briggs & Stratton motor. This one happens to be on a Craftsman PYT 9000. So just unscrew these two little, uh, whatever you call these things, screws, I guess, or... And uh, this cover pops out. Ooh, I guess it is dirty. All right, I wasn't going to change it. In fact, I'm a bad man because I got these filters back in... Uh, <laughs> I got these a long time ago. It's September. I got these in June. And uh, I did not change them yet. This particular Craftsman has a battery that's acting up. So you just do that. Push this somehow. Just pops right out of there. Yeah, that's definitely dirty. I'll give you that. So it's good to be doing this, apparently. So just pop that in there. It just snaps in, hopefully. And that is how you change the air filter, which that's pretty dirty. That definitely uh, was due to be changed. So nice new air filter in there. Pop this little cover back on. Screw it down. And we should be good to go. Actually, have two of these Craftsman mowers. Make sure this sits flush. So, two Craftsman mowers. We're going to do the other one for you, too. And uh, that's that. So, mower number one is done. So, let's pause this and I'll go to mower number two. All right, so this is Craftsman mower number two. Picked this one up this year for 500 bucks. It delivered, the guy delivered it for 500 bucks. It was like an hour and change away and I had a really busy day. Oh, all right, so this one. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, look at, <laughs> look at that one. Oh, wow. Uh, That's apparently, nasty. This dude has never changed this filter. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this is embarrassing. Wow, dude. That's bad news right there. That's full of crud. That's really bad news right like, there. Like, look at the new one and look at that one. <laughs> wow, all right. So, yeah, it's been a little, little time coming here to get this one changed. Wowee. Do you need something to blow that out or anything? Probably. <laughs> you want me to run in and... Whoa. <sighs> you want me to go get something? Nope. That's nasty. All right, so we should have changed this a while ago, but that's why we're doing it now, today, so. Sorry, little mower. Don't shame me too much. So, it just pops in there. That's it? That's it. Wow, I might be able to do that by myself. It's a simple process and obviously well overdue in this $500 special. So, I can get this to line up well. Give me this dirty, nasty thing. Whoa, this is headed for the garbage. Wow. So just tighten this down, and that's that. I mean, we cut a lot of grass with these mowers. I mean, they're not having a nice life. That's what they're made for. For some reason, it's not screwing down very well. Oh, there we go. All right. Actually, we're going to check the oil in this beast as well. Let's see if we have any oil. Oil's good. All right, well, that's embarrassing. I should have done that sooner. So that's how you change the air filter on a Briggs & Stratton mower. These are Craftsman PYT 9000s. Thanks for watching.